So traditional tax saving options, you know, are off the shelf product. Right. As you said, they offer assured returns. They come with assured returns, and uh, people prefer it that way because you know generally uh, uh, Indians are risk averse. Right. So they they always will go for something that uh, will give you those assured returns. But uh, the flip side is that assured returns are falling. If you look at the general interest rate trends, uh, if you look at the 90s, which offered double digit returns, maybe our parents were uh, getting right. those double digit returns. Today, if you look at it, they are all in single digits and largely you'll find the returns in the 8 to 9% range. True. Sure. Okay. So that's, that's one, the flip side of, you know, traditional uh, investments. Coming to ELSS, which is an equity linked product. Uh, having invested in equities, equities by their trait have got a potential to offer higher returns. Now, why do I say they have the potential? Uh, if you look at India's GDP, it's growing at roughly 7, 7.5%. Right. Add inflation to that and you have the, you know, uh, growth, India growing at roughly around 12%. Okay. okay. Now, where is this growth coming from? You know, uh, the industry, the companies, the corporates, all putting in, yeah. uh, you know, their efforts, and this is this is how the growth comes from. So generally, you can expect if the economy is growing at around twelve percent, uh, you know, after uh, inflation, your equities can also grow around the same lines. Right. So maybe less, a uh, little bit less, little bit more, but on an average, it can grow. It can grow even better. So this is if this is the growth that you can expect from equities, it's certainly better than what you are getting from your traditional, traditional. fixed income. But the only question is there is short term risk because right. equities fluctuate more than your traditional fixed income because they are of Absolutely. course they are assured returns. So that's that's where people need, need to tune in and that's why you need a little bit of risk appetite right. to invest in uh, equities. So that is the returns part. So you have the potential of getting better returns. Coming to the operational aspects, ELSS uh, as I said, each instrument has got a lock-in period. Right. ELSS has got a three-year lock-in period. Okay. Vis-a-vis -vis five years for an NSC or a bank fixed deposit, 15 years for a PPA. Okay. So it has got a relatively shorter lock-in period. So that's a good positive for uh, the ELSS. So besides the potential to earn higher returns, you also have a shorter lock-in period. So these two factors... Uh, uh, are in favor of ELSS and help you to create, uh, you know, wealth over the long run. So that is how I would put the difference between traditional savings and uh, ELSS. ELSS. Mutual fund investments are subject to market risks. Read all scheme-related documents carefully.